The okay. infamous toilet house. The Bailey is the, Moon. Wait, yeah. is that the one? Yeah, it's the Bailey Moon house. Without the toilets. Yes. I didn't build that. Oh, you didn't build that. No. After all this time, it wasn't you. I, I built the the high one. The well, one there, the very... there isn't. Okay, there, actually, no, that house is also missing toilets. We, we can go there. Hey guys, James here today, and I'm joined by Sim Guru Romeo. Now, mm -hmm. some of you guys may know him as the man behind the toiletless house. Mm. However, we just discovered you didn't even build the I infamous didn't. house without the toilet. It's not me. Which you even thought you did because that, that everyone was talking about it. I guess you never really looked at it. Yeah, I guess I didn't know what specific house it was. This lot, mm. this is the one I built. Yeah. So if you go there, there's a weird bug. If you page down to the basement and move your camera forward, mm. The only way to fix this is to actually bulldoze your entire lot. Yeah, so just move the camera, zoom in, and move the camera forward. It's gonna jump up right there. Yeah, I noticed this, I can't remember when I noticed this, and I was like, it was super annoying. I'm like, why is it doing this? We still don't know why it's happening. <laughs> is it, so it's only the pre-built lot. It's the pre-built lot. If you, if you nuke your lot <laughs> and like rebuild a lot, it fixes it. No one knows why this happens. <laughs> yeah, so I'm like why? So this bathroom is missing a toilet. Yeah, see that's my fault. And then so what's the what's the story behind the two showers? This is a sauna, spa area. With the two showers in front of a window. Yeah. Dude, you're in the pinnacles. Who cares? I mean, that's true. There's not like, there's you really be, care. There's not going to be anyone there, but no. I mean, I don't really need two showers. I mean, yeah. They're living a life of luxury. They don't really need a lot of this stuff. But yeah, so we're gonna look at some some building and mm -hmm. uh, and I'll see if we can help you out a little bit. All right, I'm I'm ready to uh, learn some tips. Okay, I'm gonna hand you the controls now. Okay. So let's build. Well, you you said you like building smaller smaller tiny homes and all that, mm -hmm. which is good because it makes furnishing a lot easier yep. and it means that you don't end up with a lot of empty spaces. So let's maybe just do like a one bedroom house, two bedroom house or something. All right. Let's uh here. Let's... And you know we can we can do some feedback along the way. See what we're working with. Okay, so this is interesting. What, what's the what's the motivation here? What's so what are I, we going for? I love houses with porches and decks mm -hmm. kind of like extending over. Um, basically, I'm thinking a little carport here, uh, kind of small modern house, mostly blocky, floor to ceiling windows, probably can't. Now we don't roof. have cars in the game. I don't know if you're aware. No, but I <laughs> when when we announced our terrain <laughs> manipulation video. Uh, I did build a garage because much like our fans, I actually like building mm. realistic houses with, you know, I, I take the toy cars, scale them up. So this is coming from a player side, not dev side. <laughs> Something I like to do with at least smaller houses like this, because sometimes you don't need like a whole column just because the house is so small. So yeah, sometimes yeah. I'll just do like a wall uh -huh. and that can usually look pretty good. Oh, interesting. Because yeah, then yeah. it kind of looks less blocky and, and all that as well. So you just do like a slight, yeah, that looks good. And then we can probably cantilever it in slightly more. So we got a little start. Um, I always like having some sort of foundation. I'm actually curious of your thoughts on this. How do you how do you like this? I think it's good, but yeah. um, the, the fact that the player facing, if you just jump in the game, no one knows where it is. Yes, that is. So when, that it, is... when it changed, everyone's like, it's not my game anymore. How do I, like, it doesn't exist. You yep, removed it. it. It was slightly challenging <laughs> how we communicate that. Um, it was, it was said in live streams and that, but not everyone watches live streams, obviously. Yeah, exactly. No, that's, that's definitely good feedback. Maybe we go bunker S. <laughs> we go bunker. I like weird builds. Let's try something weird. I mean, yeah, this is certainly uh, looking more unique than yes. a regular home anyway, so. I mean, I do work on The Sims and everything I build. I try to go, like, realistic architecture-wise, but um, I definitely make it slightly more quirky. And then when I typically build, I build out of this and just go like room by room. For me, it really depends, I think. It's kind of like, sometimes it's easier to go the other way mm. if there's something I specifically know where yeah, it is yeah, otherwise. Because yeah. sometimes this doesn't show everything where you think it would be. Like what? Well, just like if you're in the kitchen category, if you, like if you click on like the little fruit bowl icon. Oh, it's not all like, the decoratives. But it's then, like, I mean, and also half the stuff is like, well, that's not going to go on a kitchen, kitchen counter. And like, yeah, I don't it's, know why Heroes it's like on deck kitchen. is even in here. Yeah. Um, so that's, yeah. This, that's why this way can be weird sometimes. Yep. And I know you scale it down. Actually, I don't know how to do this. If I scale this down, hmm. how do I replicate the object scaled down? You don't. You There's can't. no way to do it. So feel free to add that in. That sounds that That's... sounds like a nice little uh, ad. Because <laughs> I like scaling them down. But, but it, you have to do it one by it one every single really time. It gets really tedious. Yep. And it's the same with if you move something up or down, and then yep. you clone it, then it'll just drop back to the ground. Okay. I don't, I don't know if we can easily do it, but I will do some investigation. Because I always like finding ways to... Improve yeah, there's a lot of place. little things that like quality the, of life. Yeah, exa exactly. Totally. Yeah, that are easy. Well, not easy. I mean, they they seem easy. Yeah, yeah. it it shouldn't require I us mean, to it, make a pack. Yeah, 
I feel like the outside's kind of boring, though. Don't we want to, like... I, if, so, we, if we're going bunker, don't we want to go, like... Yeah. We get some, like, weird roofs on the side. I know you like, you like I roofs. Like, I like weird like, roofs. I would, see, I was thinking if we put, like, a roof on the side or something, it could be, like, curved or just, like, a straight edge or something like oh, that. Interesting. I, I actually have never really played around with that much. Probably has to go one, on. one thing. One thing we had originally, more little dev tidbits, but mm. it was causing all sorts of problems and asserts and, like, breaking roofs. We had this little dongle on roofs. Mm. Um, it wouldn't add foundation. But it you basically allow you to pull your roof wherever. Um, we can still investigate that if people feel like it'll be super helpful. But it was causing all sorts of weirdness. Um, and it would definitely require a lot more uh, finagling to mm. figure out. So we, we let's, Well, when um, you do that in the roofs update, just make it so you can remove the wall. You can change the color of ceilings. Yes. Just yeah, put yeah. it all in one. Yeah, exactly. I like time. this, though. It's it's definitely unique, <laughs> strange, weird. Well, um, yeah, so if you're gonna use, are you going to use that little space at the top as like a little balcony? Yeah. I reckon if you could do like a half wall, and then the roof could meet the top of the half wall. That could look cool. Or. 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 or what just happened? Well, you removed the wall, but there's still a roof there. What? Wait, roof, what? Well, roofs always have walls. God, that's right. <laughs> that's what we were just talking about. Yeah, that's we how just, roofs always we have just walls. talked about this. You can put uh, a window in it, but that's yeah, about gonna, it. Or you can put you can put archways in it. Actually, a door archway. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's another way you can that's sort of get idea. get around it. Anyway. Yep. Look at I, that. Lo I love it when it lines up yep. like that. You're just like, oh, I didn't even plan for it. There you go. Okay. A little, a little quirky, weird little <laughs> sunroom. You can dine here. Maybe we we drag this out a little more. Cool. I'm into that. Can we can we do this? And then Wait, can you extend the roof all the will it reach across if you extend I don't the eaves? Oh, that's that's what I was thinking. I don't know what we do with this this little I mean, space though. You could do Okay, I reckon there's a couple things you do, at least with the gap, either join it with like little fences or just you could extend the room or you could even probably add another roof on the next level that joins it as well. Yeah. I'm going easy approach. <laughs> See now, okay, that, that's fine, but I feel like the door needs to move because, like, downstairs, because it's like weirdly yeah, in the yeah, middle. Yeah, yeah, so, like, yeah, maybe there yeah, or the other side, either way. Yeah, that looks better. Okay. I can, nice. So, here's what I'm thinking the front of it is very flat, so I think we need to either have something come out yep. or something push into it. Like, so, I really like what you guys do with the. Uh, that's I, fair. I, I, that's fair. I almost always use that get together one, which. The, like the third one. This one. Yeah, because it's just basic, basic and it looks yep. contemporary enough that you can okay. use it that way. So we can we can do and mind you we're not using move objects. I'm st I'm starting base. Well, actually, that's the other thing as well. That's important to note. I think like because you don't use it when you do. We're not allowed to use move objects because if the player gets the build and moves a thing, and they don't have move objects, so like I can never get this thing back. Yeah, well, that's the thing because people wouldn't know about it yeah. otherwise. Oh, that's annoying me. Oh yeah, so that's something that's been in the game since the the base game. Yep. I know. Like, it, it makes sense why it does that, but I feel like it should know if there's one above it that it's just, just like... That. We're going to do that. See, that, so, I, I reckon that, just, that gives it a lot more depth, like, yeah, already. Yeah, some, some texture there, and we can throw some windows. Um, it's also really cool if you use those, like, um, vertical, like, slats from... Well, I think there's, there's some new ones added in Get Famous, and then there's the other ones from... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever other pack. And you sort of, if you can put them in front of windows sometimes, it actually looks quite cool. Yeah, okay. I reckon what you could do, because there's no column on the right-hand side, you could either just have, like, a single wall coming out, like, if you wanted to have windows oh, all the yeah, way across. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, you can do, like, a little balcony. Yeah. Delio. This went from tiny house to a slightly <laughs> bigger house. See, I, I, th I think what I would do down the bottom, though, on the, um, with the wall, is maybe cut out, like, a middle section of it. Okay. Like, if you cut, like, two out of the middle... Mm -hmm. Even maybe just put like a small half wall there so you still have like the foundation oh, going some, across. Yep. Because then it sort of just keeps it a little bit more open. Mm -hmm. It doesn't feel so close. Because it doesn't need it. Like it, it's an outdoor area anyway, so yeah. it doesn't really need to be closed in. Like maybe even just like the smallest yep. half wall. Okay. Good. Well, the, yeah, the foundation. Because then that can look really good as well as if you, if you do like lots of plants and stuff nice. around it. Yep, I like it. Little... Now, this is a house. I know. It's starting to look <laughs> kind of weird, quirky. I like it. Um, the back is very yeah, boring. Yeah, we can, we can do something here. I... So I typically end up doing this at the end, where like I build everything and then I fur like I get the basic structure and then I start looking at it from the outside and I'm like, oh, I should have done this and I should have done that. But it's smart to to look at this stuff. Yeah, right it becomes really difficult later on to yeah, alter like it. Refurbish but then you also run into, if you do it this way, you run into the issue of like you look at the inside, you're like the layout. Oh, I can't. You got a really weird yeah. shape and then you're like, oh god. And then you have stuff that doesn't. There, line look, up. There's, there's issues and with both like, methods. Uh, <laughs> is this too high? No, that's that's not. It's got a, uh, it puts a column on the left, though, which is weird. Yeah. Let's go here. And then I had, I had a thing. This. 
There we go. Oh yeah, that works. Perfect. Yeah, have the, I reckon if you turn that into like a balcony that comes out and around though. Like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So to have it stick out the back. I like that idea. Okay, um, let's go ahead and do, let's just make it a balcony with no inside. I don't know I'm not sure what's happening right now. We're, we're doing, a, we're, <laughs> I'm we're not, doing a thing. Where is this go? Where, what is happening with this? We're doing a thing. Okay. Go okay. This way. Boom. Okay. So now we can do a nice little glass sliding door. I love the sliding doors. I definitely want to add more of those. We need more because I, I the know. ones that we have don't match anything. I, I know. <laughs> you're, you're, you're telling well, that's me just a regular. That's not even a sliding I know, door. But that's actually. Yeah, that's one. That, I love that door. But again, it doesn't really match much, so I never use it. Yep. Okay. Fair, fair enough. I mean, you can. Fair I'm not. Enough. You can use it. Feel free. I, like, don't don't let me stop you. But yeah. Let's. Uh, where does the sliding door? Yeah. Bottom line. There it is. Okay. Yeah. Hey, right. It doesn't match anything. <laughs> but what color <laughs> options do we have? Black. Pure black. Maybe white. I guess white. White is where we're going. We're just. Yeah. We're just gonna do white. Okay. Now we need half walls. I like the half walls with the that was that was a smart. smart that was idea. good. I like that. I've never I've never used it as like a fence. Yeah, that's good. I like it. See, we're all learning things today. We're, we're trying new stuff. Um, yeah, I like that. I kind of like this little. I need some thing. support though, because it's kind of just hanging out there a little. Yeah. Bit. How do we want to support this? Do we want to do columns? I think we should just do this. This guy. I like this. I don't know what we're gonna do with it, but I like it's it. It's just there. It's for it fun. is. It is there. See now, I kind of, ah, I kind of want. I want to put glass roofs across the whole, the whole deal, just to make this like greenhouse looking. Oh, that's. Yeah, I didn't add the no. ability to do yeah. on floor tiles, unfortunately. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> we're figuring this out. I don't think the roofs work mm, really well when you overlap them, do mm, they? No. What if you? Yeah, actually, drag, drag that all the way across. I reckon, yep. and then make it glass and whatever. And then I reckon you put like little windows on the end of it as well. Mm -hmm. No, nah, see, I reckon I think I reckon it's better below because it's more interesting. You get this yeah, little separation. the separation. And then if you put little windows oh, on that bit, yep, I like it. That Smart. could look quite cool. Uh, should we go? No. Yeah, eaves do not look good on yeah. a glass roof yep. ever. <laughs> Ever. All right. Okay. Oh, you still have that wall in the middle though. Too, uh, Actually, wait, what drag, I... drag that roof all the way along. Oh, no, because you got the other roof wall. Yep. No, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. And now you got the additional wall. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know would be nice? Uh, Glass walls. Yeah, that would be nice. That would be, that would be incredible. Also, a car to park in that driveway. Maybe. <laughs> One step at a time, James. <laughs> One step at a okay. time. Okay, well, hang on. So we've already spoken about roofs. Yep. Uh, cars. All things not confirmed walls. and not happening. Oh, no, this we're just chatting about yep. Well, this is good because in you you playing in build mode, you're like, oh, you know what would be good? This. This, this is what we need yeah. to do. This is why we're here I, playing I'm the game. I'm telling you, all the things that the players say, we're like, yeah, we really want to do that also. But it, and then it, you're it like, takes, ooh, it takes time. Yeah, it takes time, and we have to plan a, a schedule out. We have to make sure. I I just did a thing thinking we used the taller one, but we we already used the short one. <laughs> huh. All right. So do you want to fix the roof or <laughs> fix the oh just get, get rid of the bit that sticks oh, out? Oh yeah, yeah. Just, yep, just yep. change it into like a normal See, these roof are all, as well. These, like these I reckon this this whole set that just need that needs to go that roof. Okay. Because it's just it's irritating. building it's, it's building walls everywhere and it's just it's irritating. I kind of like that. Underneath the roof, we got those windows, but we're still gonna have a ceiling there because they're not a yep. glass roof. So we're gonna need to remove the ceiling. Oh yeah. Okay. So if you go click on the room below it, but usually the easiest way. Oh yeah, and just remove. Yeah. Yep. And then go, you have to go up and it's like a whole thing. And then you have to put the roof down so you can see it. Say what? <laughs> put, the, put the roof down so you can oh, see it. Oh, yeah. It's a, it's a whole thing just yeah, to do this. I it's got, not. I got it. I, yep. Oh, oh but that. That's is... all right. We can, we can, you're going to add floor back there because we only really need it yeah. open on that part. So okay. that's fine. Let's, uh, <laughs> I like, I like these. Maybe we, we duplicate this over here. I do, I do like those. Yeah, but we won't be able to do it on the level above. It's all right. We just, we just do that. It looks strange. Does it? I'm not gonna lie. Do we do we double it? Do we make it double? So what? That column's like further in than the wind. Why? Oh, on roof on roof walls oh. it places differently. You know what? I never knew that. That's something new that I've discovered See, today. We're all, we're all learning and that things. shouldn't be like that. Yeah, cause... that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. Our our uh, <laughs> our roof thickness might be different than our wall thickness. That could be why. Let's go. I like floor to ceiling glass mm -hmm. windows. Yep. Um, not these ones because of the blue hue. Should we just slap that guy on there? Can we do uh... that one place over the levels? Yep. Where's... Oh, actually, wait, maybe because it's a roof. Nope. nope. 
No, wait, make the... Yep. You can I get... See, I yeah, see, I yeah, see, yeah. I see, I see, I see. Yeah, yeah, there you go. We're going to trick... We're, we're tricking the game. This, well, this actually might work. Yeah. yeah it does. There we go. Because it is technically one wall. Boop. Looks kind of weird. Though. It does look yeah. very... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we thought we won. I mean, it's a great revelation. Yeah. But it doesn't look great. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe we don't. Oh, <laughs> hey, hey, roof. Oh, I want it to work. Yeah. Nope, it's not gonna let us have our day. What do um, we put here? Okay, so what we could. We, we here's when in doubt, cover it with plants. Oh, okay. Yep. You can do, you could either do like the green uh, wall, like ivy or something, or yeah. just put a tree in front of it. Ooh, see this. Is oh, you got to hold down Alt. What is this? It's all right. We 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 fill in the holes later. See, now I'm thinking this house would look really good with like some wood. As yep. a structure, because it would go really good with the green. Uh, as like the 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 paint. The out the yeah, yeah, yeah. That, I don't think that's gonna look good. Slightly big. Wow, that's a that's an interesting. Yeah, one. I don't think I've ever used that. Um, no, not that. I can go go into the masonry category. Yep, I always enjoy. Because there's doing... there's that one that kind of looks like wood in masonry. The that, tech, it yeah. just adds a little texture. I like that. I like. I can do that, but not on the whole house, right? Yeah, yeah. And, so, and, and then we for, split it. But that part, and then I can use one of these. Probably this one. Yep. And then do like a brown, because that's like the brown texture, and then that will sort of mix Oh, that's going to be slightly annoying. That's all right. Uh, this one? No, 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 that, that, that one. Yeah, make it like the second one probably is usually good. Like the second color swatch is a bit darker. Are we into that? Yeah, I reckon so. Okay, let's do it. So if you do it, there, yeah, that, that's... Too much? Too too crazy? I reckon that bit there is good, but you're going to have to color this wall here as well. Maybe just either side of it, just like yeah, there and the other side. Not like Not all the way along. Oh, oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, so just like the two tiles. Yep. So it sort of continues up. Mm-hmm. Because then you get a mix of the brown. Oh, but then it's not going to... Uh, I think that looks okay on the yeah, roof, actually. actually. Um, Breaks it up. Do we do this? Nope. No. Nope. <laughs> as soon as you did that, no. <laughs> nope. Yeah. Do we... Uh, maybe, maybe. Dude, I like that. That looks... Okay. Good. I reckon the front looks really good. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Um, I kind of like that. I do like that too because it's kind of like a little sunroom. Yeah, anyway. so it, it breaks it up from the house. Okay, this is uh, actually this, this is looking this good. Is see, if I see this come up in a new game, you're like, oh hey, or something similar. You'd be like, you'll be like, you know what? I want to rebuild this. Mm -hmm. This is coming back. This is good. This is good. Um, I like the the grass wall. I've never done that. It's a it's a nice little. Useful I think it wall. works well with this build the particularly. Wood, yeah, the it's wood like, it's, and it's a, it's a weird build as well. It's not mm -hmm. exactly a regular house. Now we only have like. 12, 11 minutes left. Really. All right, we, so we got to... I reckon what we get done is just get a quick floor plan. Yep. We don't really need to furnish, I don't think. Okay. So we need to figure out stairs, because that's kind of important. And then, what, oh, do, yeah. what even is the down... What, what are we doing downstairs? Is this, like, kitchen area, or, like... So I was hoping to get a basement, because okay. it's, like, a weird bunker deal. Yep. So that's going to be slightly challenging, but I imagine we'd want to go into the roof of the basement, so you access that here. Okay. Um, so if well, I, it seems we had to walk right up to the edge of that, though. Maybe. Oh, this is not going to let me do what I wanted to do. I'm curious what the telemetry is. Like, I'm sure we can get this information on how many players actually uh, change wall heights on their builds. Because, mm. like, I think the default is pretty good. The problem is when you get to taller walls, there's not a lot of stuff you can do with them. Yep, that's true. <laughs> that's we're, the we're, issue. Like, the number of <laughs> windows that are available is a lot less. That's fair. And you end up with like, oh, I like that door, but it's only available it's, in the... And you put yeah. a tiny door on this giant wall, yeah. and you're like, well, okay. One thing I don't know how to do, you can maybe shed some light on this, is how to do the grass, uh, like, lattice things. What do you What do you use? Normally if I do that, I just use, like, one of the little fences. I just, like, drag it across, oh, and then just yes. put, like, the plants on top that, of it. That's what you do, okay. Yeah, yeah. So you use... Either, like, that um, tiny little one from... One? That one's good, yeah. Or well, there's that other one from the other pack that I've forgotten. Not that. Do not use this, it. Yeah, this, that one. Yeah, yeah that one. Yeah, that perfect. one's always a good okay. one. So basically, you just you do this dealio, right? Yep. And that just looks like a little bit of a lattice, and then you just get in some plants on top of it. Mm-hmm. Okay, great. Done. I like that. We need stairs going up, at least. And down. We haven't got any stairs. No anyway. stairs. Yeah, we, we got to get... We need at least stairs, and then we're good. Okay. Um, what stairs are we going to use inside? I... I like these ladder-like stairway. That's good. Okay. Okay. There we go. Ah, that fits pretty nicely, actually. And then we could probably just put the other ones above those, can't we? Yeah. Stack yeah. them. Might actually fit. Perfect. 
Look at that. That's not perfect. Where because you got the one tile that's still there. You either got to move the stairs along one no, or we, we cut you, out that floor tile. There we go. We give you a gap. Although, what does it look like upstairs? Where is it going? Uh, oh, no, that's all right. That, that'll that actually work pretty well with a floor plan. Yeah. You just put a wall straight across that bit and you're good. Like this? Well, yeah, I would probably just cut that whole section off, maybe. Because that could either just be one bedroom. Like a really big bedroom or we can make it two yeah. smaller ones. Because you could have a door on either side. Mm -hmm. Upstairs bathroom. And then what? Tiny office. Tiny office. It's a study. A little study and then our bedrooms are over here. Bedrooms? Mm -hmm. Yeah. How would you, where would the doors go? Um, we we see what I was thinking. If you put a wall here and then just have like a shared bathroom or something, I guess with the two. We can just use. It's a weird sized bathroom, but. Ah, uh, yeah. So you're saying that, and then we two doors come through. We have to wait. Wait, what? Well, I just but that's just a bathroom off the hallway. So you just yeah, have yeah, a door yeah. in the hallway. Oh, geez, as I take out your mic, I'm so sorry. So the bathroom is that one this yes that is weird it is weird but it fits so that's a <laughs> but we can't put any windows here and there's no way to get out we can put windows, well i eh? guess you can get out here this well actually way. we could even just make the bathroom smaller so it's not so weird so cut off yeah, two yeah, there yeah. then have a door out to the balcony and you're yep. golden like that yeah and then it's like perfect Maybe then it's like can... a more normal sized bathroom yes it's not a and you get out outdoor access less less chances for me to miss a toilet placement <laughs> perfect Okay. I mean, we don't have time to place a toilet anyway. Nope. Actually, you know what? We should probably do it just for the sake the of The sake of So things. we place a toilet, but nothing else. It's the complete 180 <laughs> of what I normally do. Why is cat's walk on? Uh, toilet! And, and for the sake of it, it's going to be a talking toilet. In uh, the middle of a room. <laughs> With bushes in it. Yeah. There we go. Lovely. That's the <laughs> finest work yet. <laughs> okay. And it is weird. So I, I do this weird thing. Where I like having glass doors in my bathroom. See, that's fine if it's an ensuite. Yeah. Like, I think that is actually fine for an ensuite bathroom, but for, like, one that's in a hallway... Probably not the, not <laughs> yeah, the move. Yeah, you, you know what I mean? Like, an ensuite bathroom, that's fine. Yeah. You know, like, that's your space, but... Ah, oh, man, see, so, like, what are we what are we doing here? How's... <laughs> how do we... What interior doors are going to fit this, like... See, Weird. you know, if that basic door that we had there, that one, if that just had a black or a white, we'd be... Are you, oh, you mean like just something nope. with yeah, not... Yeah, but we don't wood. have that. Yeah. Because yeah. uh -huh. it's just a really standard door. But then oh. you get the, all these like weird we traditional doors <laughs> that don't really match. Look, I hear what you're saying. And actually, no, the weird thing about these, like, while we're talking about these doors, originally most of them didn't have recolors. Yeah. Then you guys went back and added swatches mm -hmm. to a bunch of them. Yeah. But you skipped half of them, which I'm not really sure why. Uh, okay. So, there was... A rumor saying that this is frosted glass. Well, that's what the description says. Is it? Yeah, read it. <laughs> it's like, actually, it might be the other one, because there's a double door version of that as well. This one. I think this one says it. Oh, maybe. It, I, no. swear, I swear it used to say it. it. I swear it did. I don't know. Are you sure you're not talking about this one? No, no, no. Though, because, like, why does that door exist? Like, like this is clearly frosted yeah, yeah. glass. No, it was definitely that. I'm 100% I'm sure but it this used is like, to say it. This is like garage fire doors. Yeah, but the thing is, because people are always like, why does it exist? It's the same door as that, but with less colors. Like, it's just always been in the game, and no one knows why. It's just, it's just a mis it's like a mystery of The Sims 4. Maybe. But I guess this is the... No, because this is pack-specific. Yeah, I don't know. You, you got me. I'm curious who... No one knows why it's in the game. Our, our original art director is not here anymore, so... Because it's like a ask. weird blue door. It is slightly weird. And I'm, I'm certain, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm certain that used to say like frosted glass in the description. I don't think so. I don't know if we ever, cause it's a whole rigmarole to change text. Cause we have to get it like localized. So I doubt we would go through that work just to correct something. <laughs> I, don't, I swear it said somewhere. Maybe it wasn't on the door, but it said maybe, it somewhere. I'm, maybe. Hey, Should this, this be this, brown? Uh, uh, yes, probably. It was like, I'm liking yeah, dude. Yeah. yeah. And oh, I'm behind the windows as well. Just yeah. Kidding. Yeah. For the sake of Actually, you know what? Wait, go up a level because the roof might look weird. Oh. Yeah. Actually, we could paint the roof too. That'd probably look okay. Wait, have paint it brown. Have a look at the other side. See if that's still okay. You could even bring like, like brown walls know. down a little bit. Yeah, like you could do something like that again, on the other side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Otherwise, it's just the whole thing what with the roof wall. This? Slightly weird. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But now the whole house is brown. We don't want the whole house to be brown. Yeah, that's not good. All right, let's just... just let's, let's, as, as we were. As... Wait, a couple more. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's... That's probably fine. That's yeah. fine. That's not terrible. This is slightly annoying me, though. It's all right. I'll fix it. There we go. <laughs> Better. Well, I, okay. think, I think that's all we have time for. Bummer.
I was enjoying this. This, this was fun. A, I feel like we, nice both, we both learned a lot, me more so than you. Yeah. You you learned a couple things of like how our game doesn't work certain ways. <laughs> you also learned a few things yes. that do not work in the game. So <laughs> I did. So um, this, yeah, this has been building with Romeo. Yeah. I hope you've you know maybe not learned some stuff, but figured out some things that uh, you can do differently. I think this looks great. Yeah, we I just I, need to furnish it. Now I want to see this in an upcoming pack. Okay, save it to the gallery. So I know, I, I, know I know it definitely won't be because it has so many different packs in this one build. That's true. <laughs> so uh, it definitely won't however, be. However, we could Maxis curate this at the minimum. You heard it here first. It's going to be curated because yeah. we'll it's going to be we'll amazing. We'll see what it's I can It's confirmed. Do. You have to finish it though. No. You like we can't curate something that's not done. <laughs> so, you can upload this to your channel. This is fully mm. Romeo's build. Um, and then you make it pretty and furnish it. I know you love furnishing your favorite thing to do. Tiny builds are okay. Yeah. But when we get bigger, it's a problem. Man furnishing mansions is fun. Anyways, thanks so much for watching, guys. Thanks, Romeo, for yeah. joining me. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave your comments and suggestions down below. But I will see you next time, and have an awesome day. Bye.